Hey guys, today we're going to be making ooey, gooey, sticky monkey bread. And another name for it is, um, a lot of people call it pull apart bread. And here's what you're going to need. You're going to need a half a cup of melted butter. You're going to need honey, vanilla, a cup of brown sugar, um, two tablespoons of cinnamon, one cup of white sugar, and two of these jumbo biscuits, okay? You can use any type of biscuit that you would like to use, okay? This is a, um, a jumbo buttermilk biscuit and it has eight each and you wanna use two of them. And the first thing that we're gonna to need to do is take the biscuits out of here. Okay, this is a very simple appetizer to make. You can use this. When the game is going on, you can use this for a party favor. What you want to do is take you some kitchen shears and just cut them, okay? You want to cut it in one. You want to cut each one into fours, okay? Just like that. Okay, you can't mess it up. See that? Cut each one into four sections, okay? Until we get done with... Um, the two cans of biscuits, okay? So I'll continue to cut these and I'll come back. Okay, everybody, we're back. And see how we cut them? We cut each one into four sections. And literally, guys, I promise you, this did not even take five minutes. It was so simple, okay? Just snip it, snip each one into four sections, okay? And next, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this cup of white sugar and we're gonna put the cinnamon in there. Let me get a spoon, I'll be right back. <clears throat> we're gonna mix that cinnamon into the sugar, just like this, okay? Just like this, very, very, very simple. This is the perfect go-to dish if you guys are having a get together, if the game is on, family's getting ready to come over and you're not sure what to make. If you've got some biscuits in your refrigerator, you got an appetizer, you got a fun meal, okay? And you don't need forks for this either. Everybody can just pick off of it and eat it. Here's what you do. Take that sugar. We're going to pour it all over this monkey bread. I'm sorry, all over this biscuit dough. Okay? The sugar and the cinnamon, pour it all on there, okay? Just like that. Please get a good picture, Dakota. Okay, now here's what we're going to do. Look at this. Look how simple, guys. Toss it. Just toss it. Don't worry about smushing it. You can't mess it up, guys. That's what we're going to do. We want to get this coated very well in the cinnamon and sugar, okay? See that? Look how simple. Don't worry if some of it sticks together. It's okay. Okay? All right. Now, take a look at it, guys. Take a good look. See how it's all coated? All coated very well. Okay? There we go. That's exactly what we're wanting. Just like this. Now, I have a pan. I've greased my pan very well. And this is the pan I'm going to use. Nothing special, okay? And I'm going to put my biscuits in here. Get a good picture, Dakota. And I'm going to make a layer around into a circle, okay? Nothing hard, okay? Nothing hard. We're going to make one layer. Just like this, guys. Okay? I wanna leave a hole in the middle, okay? Just like that. Now, I'm gonna take some of this extra sugar, sprinkle it on there, okay? Sprinkle it on there just like that, guys. See that? Okay, now, come over here. We, we haven't put it all in the pan yet, okay? But hold that other half just for a second. What we're going to do is we're going to take this melted butter and the brown sugar. We'll mix it up real good. Mix it up real good. 
And this is going to be our sauce, guys. This is the ooey gooey part. Okay? Now we're going to put a teaspoon of vanilla in there. Just a teaspoon, okay? It's about a teaspoon, okay? And we're going to use some honey. It's up to you to how much honey you want to use. That's about a teaspoon. That's about two teaspoons. Three teaspoons. That's about five teaspoons, okay? Let's mix this up really good. Look at that. Look how simple. Very simple, guys. <clears throat> okay, now watch this. Come on over here. Hold on, let me get the spoon. Come on over here. Look at this, guys. Watch me. Watch me now. Watch me now. Can you get a good picture of that? Okay. Okay, take a look in the pan. See what we've done? Okay. Now we've put that brown sugar, butter, vanilla, and honey on top of the first layer, okay? Now, second, we are going to layer another top, okay? Look at this. Put a second layer. Okay? Look at that. You don't have to press it in. You just kind of let it fall where it falls, okay? I'm, I want to leave a hole in the middle like that, and that's just fine. Okay? Because I want mine to look like a ring. Okay. Just like that, guys. Now, I'm going to come. That extra cinnamon and sugar, I'm going to put it right on there. And also, I have my oven on 350, guys. My oven's on 350. We're going to cook this for 20 20 to 25 minutes, at the most 30 minutes, okay? But when it's done, I'll definitely let you guys know um, how long I've cooked it. A good buddy of mine, uh, Courtney, she was telling me that she made a pull-apart bread. And I said, ding, 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 that's it. I need to make a pull-apart bread. And so thank you, Courtney. I will definitely let you know how this turns out. I love you, Courtney. You are awesome. I hope you enjoy the video. Okay, so let's let's do this here. And you know, Courtney, actually, I would bring you some, but I won't see you until you get back from vacation, and I'm sure this will be gone by then. But if you want me to make you some, I'll definitely make you some. Okay, let's see. So what we're going to do now, we're going to come back to the brown sugar come back to the brown sugar glaze remember it has that honey and butter in there go right on top of there look at that it's beautiful already guys isn't it it's beautiful okay let me scrape this into there okay I'm getting ready to put this in the oven let me take that little bit of extra sugar Toss some on top. We're going to throw this in the oven on 350 and I'll be back. Okay, guys, I'm back. I'm actually peeking through the oven door. I don't know if you guys can see a good picture of that. This is what it's looking like. Let's look in the oven real quick. Oh, see that? It's working, guys. It's working. Let it cook a little bit longer and I'll be back. Okay, guys, I'm back. The monkey bread has cooked for 25 minutes on 350. And look at it. Ooh, look at it. I can't wait to flip this over, okay? And I'm going to just flip this over into a uh, baking sheet, okay? But what I need to do, I need to let this sit for 10 minutes, okay? But you don't want to let it sit too long because it'll stick to the bottom of your pan, okay? So let's give this 10 minutes. I'll come back. We'll flip it and we'll see the results. Okay, guys, the monkey bread has been flipped successfully into the baking pan. Look at this, guys. Come on, guys, give it up for me. Look at it. Now, I'm not going to dig in right now. I'm, I've got to give it at least five minutes because I don't want to burn. I don't want to burn my mouth, okay? And that sauce is burning up right now. I don't want to burn my mouth. But would you look at this? Great recipe, very simple, beautiful. My whole house smells like a cinnamon bun right now. From downstairs to upstairs. My house smells so good right now, guys. This 
is beautiful. And guys, honestly, if you haven't made this before, make it. You know, give it a try. You can't go wrong with this recipe. Look at that. Look at this, guys. I'll be back once it cools down and we'll dig in. Okay, everybody, we're going to go on in. It's still warm, okay? Normally, you'll pull it apart with your fingers, but since it's so warm, I'm going to go ahead and use this fork, okay? And let's see what happens. It should pull right apart. See, look at that. That's why this is called pull apart bread. You see how simple? Let's try that again, guys. Oh, oh my Lord, have mercy. Look at that. Okay. Get a good picture, Dakota, right there. Oh my goodness, look at this love, guys. This right here, this is what you call love. Mm. That is love, guys. I'm going to dig in and taste this. Oh my goodness, okay. Oh, wait, look at that. Is that beautiful or what? And look at the fluffiness, guys. Isn't that beautiful? Let's take one more piece out. Whoops. Hold on, let me wipe that off. I want my plate to be clean. Okay, let me try this. Look at that, guys. Look at this. Let's give it a try. Bear with me because it's going to be hot. Hold on a second. Mm. Oh, guys, make this. This, one more bite. Hold on. Mm. This right here. This right here. Mmm, mmm, mmm. So delicious. Oh, when you guys are on the weekend sitting at the kitchen table playing cards, make this for your friends. You don't need any forks. All you need is fingers and stomachs. <laughs> All you need is fingers. Everybody can grab on in with their fingers and an empty stomach and everyone will be happy. This is a winner. Mmm, 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 mmm. Nicole, you want to try it? Sure. Okay. It's hot now. Be careful. Mmm. That is good. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Mm. Nobody. Nobody does it better, guys. Follow these recipes. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe. And as always, God bless and have a great night.